Hello everyone and welcome to this video on my RFID access control system. Um, I'm going to show you the inside here um, and then I'm going to do a quick thing on the outside and that's it. Um, so right now on the inside I have this RFID reader which I got for $16 at my local KW Surplus. Um, so my local surplus store. They sell them. They sell a lot of Elman products which this is one of them. And I also got these cards. This one came with it. I do have a stack of 10. Um, that unlocks the door. And the one on my keys also unlocks the door. But any other one fails. So, put that one over, it fails. And this is the code for this Raspberry Pi. Um, that one has a much more complicated program because it deals with the exit button, the keypad that's on the other side of that wall, um, and all of that stuff. So we're going to go outside. This is the exit button. And we are going to take a look. So I'm going to take a card. i got to be quiet because Tyler's sleeping. I'm going to close the door. I'm going to bring this card. And I don't have to be very close. I just have to be within an inch of the wall. And it'll unlock the door. Now, pin pad is there, and it also works. That was the original design. And yeah, um, sorry for the cluttery desk, but yeah. It's my dinner. Great place to put my dinner on a, on a 3D printer. Anyways, um, so yeah, it works from the inside and the outside. Um, inside, I mean, I guess doesn't really need to work, but that's where I've figured I'd mount it, so it'd be easier to use. Um, and so this system comprise, is comprised of that box up there, which does all of the hard work, um, and that cable there supplies 12 volts and a sensor output to this button here, which this button um, is not actually a button, you can't press it, it's proximity, so whenever something gets close to it, like your hand, it'll unlock. Um, it's been get, getting progressively more touchy, and we have them on both sides. They're both getting a little touchy, and I don't know why. Um, like, they won't work, like, that That time it worked, but other times it, it won't. And I don't know why. I guess my hands aren't reflective enough or something, um, because they'll work with a, foot, with a reflective vest from across the room. And then this box down here, um, sends the power through the wall to the, uh, strike plate, which is in here, and that's that chunk you hear as the door opens, and actually one of the major clicks. The... Yeah. Um, that's one of the major clicks, is this clicking. And up there, you can see the two relays, the breadboard that kind of ties everything together, and the mess of wires that ties everything to the Pi and power and all that. And that orange cable is power from the ceiling over there. And this is just a mess, too. Don't comment on my light fixtures hanging from the ceiling. People need to not make shitty light fixtures. Anyways, that's the code, and I will see you in the next one, because I have to go. And I have to go to bed, because i got to go to school tomorrow. So, I will see you in the next one. Like, comment, and subscribe. And goodbye.